Welcome, welcome to today's vlog. Welk. See the size of that welk? That's a welk. Welcome to the welk of our name. Look at that. The welk. The welk of our name. <laughs> okay. Today's vlog ain't anything to do with the well. I just, I just, I just rode down here because I, I wanted to do a welcome with a well. That's it. That's all I wanted to do. But look, I need to go to Raleigh. I do. I do. I went there yesterday and we got rained out. I went. I need to do some more drone footage. I've changed the settings on the drone. I need to get higher than 120 meters that's regulated to so i need to break the uh, i need to go into uh, controlled aerospace so i can get some proper <laughs> images that one desires also i need to do a little bit more filmmaking with these boat guys that um i, I am since i've been going to raleigh nearly every day even yesterday it was a total wash up but i did manage to get some really good footage as i am trying to make films as such not not nothing too mad just just trying to capture the feeling of of where i am so today is i've been up i've been up and down the road for the last hour looking at the trying to read the sea and reading the weather okay now it looks like all right it's choppy i can see that it's choppy the boats are going out and I can see out there that it looks really clear. It looked like that yesterday. But due to the high wind, it's going to make flying the drone really awkward. And MC is going to be... Well, so I'm winging it at the moment. Not right for me at the moment. I'm not going to Raleigh today. Not yet, I mean it could, the wind could stop and it could get out to be a really hot day but it's overcast, we had loads of rain yesterday through the night. Uh, I mean absolutely massive storm through the night last last night. Had our job getting to sleep but... So that's where I am, so today's vlog is... Oh man, I put the... Oh my battery's gonna run out, I haven't charged my camera up. I've not vlogged for a few days, I've not, I've been... Um, I've been filmmaking, I've been using my camera and my drone. I've created a bit of time and space for myself to do what I really want to be doing on this journey is making short films. I really do. Um, I do. <laughs> so, today's vlog is... Well, how much money do I actually spend in a day whilst in Krabi, visiting Raleigh, in my general day, which is basically very much the same each day I can see more people arriving for the bus so how much money do I spend in a day well first things first my apartment 420 baht a night and it's my last night here tonight so I might have to extend that for two more days I've been here man I've been here 12 days so yeah I might make it two more days for two weeks you see the boats are coming in and out, but if that wind stays this strong, it's, it, there's no point in me going there because my drone will get... Well, I don't, know. I don't know. So, right, let's go and spend some money. Right, the first stop is a liquid breakfast. And that brings us to 7-Eleven. And down here, 7-Eleven don't have the mask uh, police in control. They're quite happy to serve you we're going in what about putting a mask on they're really cool about it it's already kept so we're going in 7-eleven for my liquid breakfast which starts with one of them we'll have today my vitamin a b and c and you know what we'll have one of them as well 
with some vitamin C and also moving over here oh, two for 19 baht instead of 24 say three but I only want one let's have one of them and that is it that is my liquid breakfast first breakfast that's me getting some goodness into me and Good up. Cup and cap. Thank you very much. The stroke block going. Not scanning. Go on then. Cheers, buddy. Thirty two bars. Okay, well, great start to the day. Got me liquid breakfast. And they are, these gels, they are just literally that. Unscrew. They're really cold, really refreshing. Oh, that was awesome. It's like being back in the Tour de France again. On me, on me, on me gels. Right. I forgot how much that was. I, I, I did say how much that was, didn't I? 32 baht. 10, 20, 12, yes, 32 baht. So I had that on the 420. And I'm now, I'm now gonna go for another ride up just to see. So I'm keeping an eye on the weather at the moment. I wanna make that journey. But if it's going to be really choppy and the wind, see the wind has dropped. That wind keeps dropping and I'm going to be getting on a boat. But if not, I'm going to be doing something else. I don't know. Well, I have not bought a boat ticket. I've been hanging around the boat stop for quite some time. Keeping an eye on the weather. Now I know the weather looks good all on the left which is where I want to go, but look, all this weather is moving in from the right. And it's still a bit rough. So, I'm not going to Raleigh just yet. I have come right to the end of Al Nang Beach, past the um, all-inclusives, and I've seen this trek. And I believe this little trek that I am about to make, I've, I've gone and put my merrells on, so I'm not got my flip trops on. I've got proper boots on and socks. So we can make this little trek, which I believe, excuse me, I believe, that would look a little bit slippery. No, it's just, well, we're managing Look at this little trek where we're off to. And we're off to the private Santara Beach. I hope <laughs> that is <laughs> what I believe to be at the end of this trail. What they call the little secret trail to the Santara little secret beach, private beach. Well, I bet there'll probably be hardly anybody on here. And, uh, let's get really close to these rocks. So I'm gonna keep an eye on the weather. Hope it will get better. So I don't wanna be stuck in the apartment again. Whoa, it's hard work being stuck in the apartment. <laughs> it is. I'm going to nip up to 7-Eleven for more Leos and whatnot. Oh man, this, this ain't a bad little trek. Oh man, you see how shitty the sea is after the storm we had last night? Oh man.
as this trek goes on. It's not going all round the mountain, and I think it cuts through the mountain, which is really good. Oh, really good. Here comes somebody else, heading my way. Okay. It's good solid structure, they're old deals by the looks of it. Scaffolding deals. It's really good. Got my little legs are aching from my tiger cave walk. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> Jess darling, you hold on tight. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, it's a bit of the trek, look. It is. Upward steps. Pretty cool. Oh, man. Wicked tree. Oh, man. It's wicked how the tree is just all these great big roots overgrown the rock no it is awesome Whew. oh you are entering a national park area no smoking don't feed the monkeys don't do this don't do that fuck off <laughs> Okay. Okay, we're still running. Yeah, got a little patch. Left. And after I've been to this beach, wow, I will go and see how much money I can spend today. I might. I, I doubt it, but I might even still go to Raleigh. <coughs> Don't know. This track is pretty cool. Right, hang in there. Okay, we ain't far off. Look, that's steps at the start and at the finish are more or less the same because, well, you've got to climb up and down and then there's a little walk, little flat walkway, which is okay. It's about a 15 minute walk quite easy it's pretty cool I've got a little bit of a sweat on which is good come the security to get me to sign in Swaddy cab we won please show your oh, that's fucking you yeah. I haven't got them with me have I mate it's ridiculous do you want me to sign in it's like please show your vaccine to come on the beach like, it, it put a sign at the start, right? It fucking tied crap. Then I'll, I'll sign in, mate, but I ain't got my bags in, do you mean? Uh, I'll leave in the Oh, I'll come in there. Yeah. All right, mate. Not inside. I ain't going inside, mate. Get, have a word with your boss okay. and put uh, a sign at the front. You want me to sign in? You need to speak with your boss, buddy, yeah? This, at that end. Yes? Fucking bug me, man. If only. I look at all this shit on this bed. <laughs> Fucking. I don't know if piss me off. It's like. Hang on. Look all fucking beads stuff washed up <laughs> oh mate don't half nip my up nip nip me up continuity you're gonna do something do it properly or don't fucking bother Thailand you're a joke you really are a joke you look like you do mate Thailand is begging schemy it's bust thing of it is the Thai bar is growing in strength against the against the British pound. The 
British, the British are funding or supplying a war. How, how, how can the British pound be falling off a cliff against the Thai bar? Wars are the most profitable, war and pharmaceutical <laughs> items, right? Are the most profitable things on the planet because the, the products are built and made with investors' money. Investors like a high return on their 15 year investments. That's why war, machine guns, tornado, <laughs> missiles, they cost a lot of money. And also the pharmaceuticals. And if I'm not mistaken, Great Britain has made a lot of pharmaceuticals just recently. So it's a joke. How is the pound losing against the Thai bark? It's outrageous. But the Thais don't have an economy at all. If they cleaned up their beaches <laughs> and got some continuity about them, then they have may have, then they may have some form of something, but right now I do not see it. Still, the sun looked like it's coming out. Now you, you can imagine how much this place would cost, right, to stay. A lot of money. Right, but look at the shit on the beach. No one comes out and clean this up. None of it, look. That's the sh one of the shit someone's foot. Is that a foot? What is that? A foot? What is it? It's a foot. A mannequin's foot on the beach. And that's like hotel guest only. Mate, how shit the beach is. Would you want to go in the hotel? I wouldn't. <laughs> right, I'm going to show you how they ship, ship that guest in. I mean, this is a pretty spectacular view. These wonderful mountains. Especially that one, which is awesome. I, I see this every day when I go out on the boat, but... <laughs> look, look, you see the pontoon? Right, this is how people come and go to get into this hotel, <laughs> right? <laughs> this is how the rich are ill-treated <laughs> to get to their posh hotel. <laughs> it's like running the gauntlet. I'll get in there, I'm speeding up. That pontoon is awesome. It's like some sort of, it's like a game. like a test of wits look look at these people right vastly overweight <laughs> right <laughs> and they've got to get to these boats what are now taking them off to the mainland look they've got two two girls have got this guy <laughs> oh this is awesome look man it's fucking brilliant oh i'm so glad i came here today this is look look, look at this right they try to get these fat rich people Right, on, on this thing. <laughs> Funny as fuck. Look at here, they've got two people on him. These are next to go, look. And look, 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 they're all queuing up. Oh, today, <laughs> I've got a good game. I love a game. And this is this, look at this. It's awesome. Now they've got the woman. She's bound to go. <laughs> It's fucking brilliant. God, I wish I was that fat and had that much money and made my life. <laughs> oh, it's funny, man. It's fucking brilliant. Look at the luggage. Mate. <laughs> Fuck it, that poor woman's down. Oh mate, that's the bloke. The bloke is down. You see? <laughs> oh mate, this is class. Class. I've got to get the big camera out so I can zoom in 
and get this in its full glory. Ah, today's vlog is taking the piss out of the ridge. Oh, this is funny, man. Okay. <laughs> Uh, hang in there, I'll, I'll edit the big camera shots in. This is fucking funny. <laughs> oh mate, the boat is going! This is fucking brilliant. It's so good. Try to get these people on the boat. The woman, is she on? Whee! <laughs> fucking amazing. Look. Whoa! <laughs> you ever seen anything? So incredible, man. There's a long tail boat there. You see it getting bucked about everywhere. Look. <laughs> yes. Oh man, this is this is this is gold, mate. This, this is something else. I like the boat is away. Ah, <laughs> oh, no way, man. You see the luggage going on to the long tail boat. Bad, okay, the long tail boat is taking the luggage. <laughs> oh, you say they're just swinging it in there, man. You said I'm just fucking throwing it in. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I think that sea is actually starting to calm down. Ah. <laughs> I'm actually glad I did not get on a boat earlier myself. That was a decision I had to make. <laughs> and I made the right one for the moment. And I think they more or less got everybody on. As the sea has calmed down a little bit, but that... <laughs> that was so entertaining. All right, there's still a few stragglers. With this old boy, will they get him on? There we go. Oh, ladies, can you walk behind me? Oh, yeah. Cheers. <laughs> It's just good fun if you want to laugh. When you watch these people try to get on the boat, it's fucking hilarious. It is. One of them's fell over already. Really? Yeah, I'll be filming. Watch him uh, uh, try to get on the boat. What? what? Why? It looks there, but it's not fun for these people. Yeah, yeah, you're quite slim and probably got a bit of agility about you. This is brilliant. That's, that's my favourite part of my day so far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> come on, get the old boy running. Odds, come on then, right, odds, odds on. Will he fall over or will he make it? Will he? He's now, hang on, there's two assistants. No, he's run past. <laughs> He's 
people here. I think this lady's got to be fucking sick before she even start her her run. Hey, imagine why? Why are you there? Would you come and stand back on these boards, man? Those girls are going for it. They said they were. <laughs> Boats, man. <laughs> so those girls said it'd be good fun, but like, you know what I mean? They're not vastly overweight, are they? Yeah, stop. <laughs> <laughs> right, well I've got to have a go at that. That's me taking the piss. Oh, what a lovely view. Not bad. Game. <laughs> well, I think the boat on the right is still hanging about and I believe he wants to come in to re-embark. Ah, oh, the boat on the left is away, I think. So yeah, this boat on the right has got to come back to pick these people up. Great fun. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. But I'll have a little bit more for you in a sec or two. Um. <laughs> oh, I think, hang on. I'll give it a so I'll come back to when. So when they get, oh, they got the old boy. He's moved. <laughs> Throwing the rope in and it didn't reach. The old boy's got to get on this boat. They got him up there. They just need to get the boat anchored. Oh, hang on. Here goes. <laughs> He's away. Oh, hang on, son. Yo. The ladies next. Oh, just when I thought it was ending, we've got a final run. So I hope you're enjoying the commentary of today. <laughs> it's fucking awesome. So where are we? Where are we? Who, me? No, I'm, I'm all good. I'm all good. I'll have a go when you're all gone. I'll have a go when you're all gone. You'll all get in the way. It's good fun though, yes, yeah? good fun. Here she go. Okay, what are the odds? Will she get there? Um, I, I reckon it's a 50-50. <laughs> the old boy up in front. Whoa, she's hanging on. She, she's, oh, she nearly went. And the third and final contender is away. So we have the last three. <laughs> oh, man, what would you call it? The rolling road? The rolling road game. <laughs> Today, it's in the time. Whoa! She nearly went. She nearly went. <laughs> anyway, the old boy is on the boat. The old boy just stepped on the boat. So we have the last three, four, hang on. Let's get all the action in there. Let's take a quick zoom up to the front to the boat. See what's going on there. It's almost gone. <laughs> and let's bring it back. Oh, it's a shame I didn't get the drone up. <laughs> oh, mate.
Okay. There's still quite a few more people coming onto the onto the starting straight. <laughs> I cannot zoom in any closer guys, unfortunately, sorry. <laughs> This likely candidate is she, she's on. Okay. Well, still another one or two contenders going forward, but they don't look quite as much of a liability as the ones that have led beforehand. You know? Ah. Well, what a great game. Guys, I hope you enjoyed that. The rolling road of... Um, the rolling road of El Nang. <laughs> well, you know, it's all right to stand there and cop the piss, isn't it? I have got my slippery merrills on. <laughs> So, <laughs> how fun is it? Whoa! <laughs> you enjoy that, ladies? You enjoy it? It is good, good fun, isn't it? Whoa! <laughs> so here we go. They say that's good fun. No aims. <laughs> da -da -da. We're walking the rolling road. Look at that, it's easy. Oh, that's disappointing. I know you guys want to see me fall over. <laughs> I apologise. Not going to happen. One is well balanced. He says. Woo! A little bit whoa, a little bit whoa. I did not know. <laughs> I did not know I'd be taking this much piss today. That's really cool. Oh look, lovely bit of raw sewage floating in. Because the boats have probably dumped their tanks while they sat here. Oh, a bit of sewage there. What a wicked view guys. Awesome. Hang on. There's some of, some of the connectors are missing, look. One missing there. There, that's for the fence posts. <laughs> We're fucking rock and rolling, boy. We're rock and roll, isn't it? How can rock us like, ah oh, man, I can learn to surf. Here come a big one. Come on. Come on. I've got the proper surf. <laughs> right, fuck this. Here come a load of rough waves, man. Great fun. Whoa! Here come another big one. <laughs> All right, where are you? Oh, I've got to fucking fall over. I've got to fall in, really, haven't I? Not going to happen. Let's see if going back is any easier. It's going to be funny walk. Fucking hell, man. That's trippy. God, doing this on mushrooms would be fun. <laughs> doing anything on mushrooms is fun. Whoa! Fucking hell, man! That was awesome! That took me by surprise! Oh, guys! What a fun day! Oh, man! I'm so glad I didn't go on the boat today. Every day is very much the same in a good way I do like Raleigh a lot and I'll probably hopefully all this weather will clear today and we'll get a bit of sun and a clear day and no winds for tomorrow and I'm gonna have to stay an extra one or two days <laughs> but guys this vlog Oh, mate, absolutely 
awesome. I hope you enjoyed the fun that I've had making it. Oh man. Well, that was great. The rolling road. Well, great game. Here come another big wave. <laughs> Can you imagine? Can you imagine what they're like if they got really big, man? So cool. Oh. Right. Breakfast. Let's go and spend some money. Okay, guys, before I leave, whilst I'm here, I mean, how rude of me. The Centara. Oh, well, I might as well have a walk round, isn't it? I am here, after all. And this is what I do. Walk about, all-inclusive resort, like I live here. You know what? The day is getting out. It is. It's looking like it's going to be an okay day. <laughs> so, I might. <laughs> what am I talking about, I might? You know what I'm going to do. Look. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Awesome. There's a little waterfall there, look. No jumping into the pool. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh, it smells of chlorine. Oh, what a little, what a wicked view. <laughs> I haven't been in one of these oil inclusions for a while. Awesome. Let's have a, God, it do smell of chlorine. It really do. Aha. There must be a slide. Must be, there is, it's a water slide. Oh, there might be. Oh, man, there's more. Okay, 1181. That's my room. Oh, yeah, look, you've got a little water slide here. Awesome. And a little pool. <laughs> that is, that's not bad. Not bad, is it? But would you <laughs> come into the resort on one of them boats? Well, one to be going out if you're vastly overweight. And let's face it, rich people are. Oh, wow, oh, man, look. Oh, nice restaurant there. Full of fish in the pond. Wicked. Wicked. Some bigger ones swimming underneath. But it's a cool. They come loads of fish, look. They think someone's going to feed them. Aha! Someone is feeding them. Awesome. Wow. Every fish. Oh man. What a cool spot. Okay. We're checking it out. And it is, look, right in the jungle. And these massive, massive rocks a bit more fish and it is like when you walk through ah oh, it's really cool it is cool uh, oh man it is super cool <laughs> I didn't know I was going to be doing this today either I didn't know I was going to be doing any of this today I thought I was off to Raleigh. Wicked. Wicked. Wow. Big one some breakfast. <laughs> one feels one needs to sit in the sun. If that wind drop, I might even fly my drone from here. I don't know. Could be some wicked drone footage. Decisions. Yes. Feeding time. Feeding time it is. Now feeding time in El Nang is hard work. It's it's run down. Where it is and the business is well I don't know. It's had its day really. 
it is really run down this battery is as well so i'm gonna be really quick the only place along el nang where i really found good food is is an indian restaurant and unfortunately today i think it's sunday and they're closed but i have found smile sorry but i love pie more than you no i do love pies and this guy has meat pies meat pie or mm. that's some nice short crust pastry proper really flaky that's proper but that weren't the meat pie that was the potato onion and cheese pie which is tasty the other one is the meat pie It's about 12 o'clock, midday, and I can honestly say, I've been keep up, I don't know, I've been up and down the road keeping an eye on the sea. It's still rough and the wind is still pushing in. So I've made the right decision today, which makes a change, is not to go to Raleigh. Because like I say, it'd be rough there, and then you get, I won't be able to do the film or drone work I want to do because of the rough winds. And then I've got a rough day coming back. So I'm staying where I am. But the food on Raleigh is really good. I found a good place to eat there. Burgers, yes. Thai food, yes. And also omelette for breakfast. Um, so I missed out on that today. But, mm. the pie is okay, but there's too much tomato in there straight away. Yeah, tomato, tomato puree, tomato base. Used to thicken to make a gravy. And that pie, as good as it is, It's like eating a bolognese pie. It is. That is. That's beef and tomato, not so much onion. And that is. It's, it's tasty. The pastry's really good. You see my pies. Look, that's the one I'm delving into. You can see the tomato in there. That is a beef and tomato pie. Bit of onion. Like I said, it tastes like spaghetti, but it's bolognese. That is what that is. <laughs> Disappointing. It, it's good to pay everything good about it. It's just that I would change the recipe and get all that tomato out there. Tomato puree and, and chopped tomatoes. Get them out there, mate. Don't need them. Don't need them. I'd put some potato in them instead. Or onion. Or more beef. And I have to be clinical because the pies are 120 baht each, which is three quid. Outrageous. It's not cheap, but I need some quality grub. Food in and around Al Nang has, believe me, been hard to find. Now I found a night market last night where I actually got some of the best chicken I'd ever had. And so hopefully, oh, excuse me. That was my battery dying, sorry, but I've got to eat both pies. Sorry, something to look at while I was eating. What's up, fucking? I want to talk so I can't put a load of food in my mouth. Anyway, those pies, I bet both of them. I'm not needed a cup of tea, not needed a Leo, not needed any beverage whatsoever, which is a really good testament for the moisture of them pies. They're pretty good. And I hit the spot. It really are. And because it's between 11 and two i can get to the 7-eleven and buy a shitload of leos for the freezer so what a bonus day this is turning out to be hang on the last bit of my beef pie so 120 baht 120 baht that is 240 baht to add to the total thus so far 
let's not forget what this vlog is. This is this is a vlog about how much money I spent today. Okay, a slight return from 7-Eleven with two times two small Leo. That's 75 baht each. So that brings our total up <laughs> to, oh, we'll add another 150 baht as I take one out that I froze earlier so I can enjoy uh, a midday layout. Oh man. He says as he comes out of the apartment in the jungle. And I have the last bit of the sun. Because oh, my weather predictions are getting better. It's gonna rain. So anyway, cheers. Oh that's overdue. Oh mate. Oh the ice cold. Ah, oh, the liquid, the liquid life filters back into one soul. Up to just a wee swig of Leo. I wonder if they use that as an advert. I don't think so, what do you think? I think they make a good advert for alcohol, I don't think so. Oh, instant twat, just add some Leo. Funny stuff. I've had a really good funny morning. <laughs> I'm still laughing about the rolling road. Mate, it's just, you know, I couldn't make stuff up like that. I'm so glad. I hope you guys thought that was as funny as what I did. Persecuting people at their own misfortune. I know, it's funny. When someone falls over, you fucking laugh, don't you? It's funny. Other people's misfortune is somehow somewhat fucking funny. It is. It is. Oh, well, they've got a cane this, and there's something else that I need to go and purchase. Unable to get to the the boat bar today uh, and sit a few Leos and enjoy my afternoon. There's another little bar that I go to, but there's something else that I need to purchase, which is not daily, but by daily to a point. So I need to include that in my bill. I mean, oh mate, we need to have one more guzzle on that and then that's gone. So the sun is still a little bit will, you know, but I, I need to go out and get something. I need to go and see a man about the dog before it starts raining again because I know that I'm going to be stuck in that apartment or in my little jungle. You see my little jungle, don't you? It is wicked. My little jungle here where I like to sit, smoke, smoke, and have a beer. Happy days. And it is wicked. It is wicked because there's no one else here. Hardly. <laughs> wicked. Right. Let's drink this. Then we're going to see a man about a dog. Okay. As you come out of Oh Nang, oh man, for a few k's. Hang on, look where I'm going. Now I've got to look out for snakes because there has been rain and I have been warned that there could be snakes down here in the rain and where I am <laughs> you know that old abandoned house is just just there and I've come to the coffee shop that I came to when I first got here um, out of town and it's the only one that had decent proper buds in jars and such like so that's a little restaurant just up there which I'll probably film it when I leave but I wanted to I think I told you that I came here these guys they've got the natural 
that wicked tree the natural water is coming through here they did say when it's wet the snakes come but they what they're gonna do look with this land that little tray they've got some lights and that you know this is going to be wicked they're building this clearing here this is going to be part of a, a stage so they can have parties out here oh mate, oh, mate mozzie heaven loads of mozzies wow so yes this is what they're building <laughs> Oh, I think that's where they live, that little shanty town there, look. Yeah, all through there, that's where they stay, the shanty town. As this all comes through, I thought that I could perhaps walk along, but no, that looks as far as I'm going. Oh, mate, and the jungle is full of mozzies. Whew. So yes, so I'm now picking up a bit of ganja, a gram of diesel, diesel power or something that was called for 500 baht so add 500 baht yeah i'm coming <laughs> that's him just come back he's been for a while ah it's okay okay cap. that was really nice looking at that um so that was me just killing a little bit of time <laughs> in the garden as i do and this is i'll show you this place I just got in the main road so when you're coming into Al Nang you recognize it it's got a wicked sign that that is wicked and he's got a sign company that's the big main rock where I was flying my drone or Centara today and that's the road back to Krabby and that's the guy sign design oh so, I might even be having some stickers made of my own. Cool. I'll show you me where's when I get home. So that, add another 500 baht. To the bill for today. Haha. -ha. We're back. After a busy little day. I do have to admit. <laughs> did enjoy me day today. I've just now, well, I've been woke, woken up about an hour, freshened up, and I am on the beach up at the very end of Al Nang. You can see how far the tide has gone out. I'm so glad I didn't get on the boat today because the boats, you won't be able to see them. Then I stuck on the edge there, unable to get into the estuary because the tide is so low. So if you come back with one of them boats, you'll have to walk quite a long way to get to shore through all this. Well, it's really silty and muddy up there. But we're going over here. Fucking hell. <laughs> that was a brick or something. I just try, I can't believe I've done that. I well, hope you found that funny. It's another one. I'm tripping. <laughs> Laughing at other people's misfortune. There you go. What goes around comes around, I guess. Right, I'm going to walk through here because I want to try and avoid that music. And I came here yesterday try some food food was all right but what was really really good was the fried chicken finger licking freaking chicken <laughs> hello security police look you got your mask on cap that's not working oh thank you <laughs> ah okay i had my hand upside down dyslexic you know <laughs> so we've come out for an early evening now i hope you've been keeping score on how much i've spent because i haven't and there's a bar there and hammer lady <laughs> that's a nice little market usual tit i'm gonna walk through here because i want to see the man with a finger licking freaking fried chicken which was really good it's down here Swaddy cap, hello, on here. Ah, Swaddy cap, Swaddy cap, that chicken. There. Yes. Yeah, I know. I had last night. I'll come back. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. 
Okay. Yes. No, I've got me chicken. I can sit at that bar and eat the chicken. <laughs> can I sit at the bar? Okay. Ah. You can take 70 baht or 25 baht. Oh, hang on, mate. I oh, won. Well, this way. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. That bit. And, and that bit. It's okay. Yeah. Can, you, can you change? Oh, you have some more? I don't, mate. I'm sorry. Okay. Ah, man, I haven't. It's, it's a thousand. Can do? Okay, I'll get at okay, the bar. You can yeah, yeah. You can buy a small Leo. That's, that's all I have. Oh no, I don't, darling. Can do. Oh come on, I need to pay the chicken, man, and I want a Leo. Why ain't no one got any change? <laughs> oh, where can I go? Hang on. Got me chicken. I had 50 baht in change. Now, now there's a bar. There's plenty of stuff. There's plenty of stuff. All, all the normal stuff you see at the market, look. Fish, it's all just going on fresh. Hello, Swaddy Cap. 10 baht each, look. For a bit of, bit of chicken or pork on a stick. Got fresh fish. <laughs> more chicken, more sausages, salad, pies. Hello! Oh man, look, battered chicken. Ah, uh, right, it's getting noisy, but the bar's right over there. Why don't they turn the sound off? That's so annoying. I'll tell you what, it's eat me chicken. <laughs> and then, I'll go and get a beer. I'll let her have her at the end, and all on my own. That's disappointing. Let's sit over here. There's a lady cannot change. My beer. Huh. Right. Uh -huh. Perfect. Take some chairs over here. Uh -huh. By the weed bar. Right there, look. That's what he kept. It's got a little bit of light, light, light music in the background. That shouldn't really matter. Over there. The chicken looks so good. It is really, oh, it's red hot. So, lumps of chicken, really big lump of chicken. Mmm, <laughs> crispy. Man, that is so crispy. Crunchy, even. Very succulent piece of chicken, that. Oh. And only 50 baht. Mmm. It's not a bad little area at all. <laughs> Just looking around. Well, it should be quiet. Peaceful, half of the music. Mm. Mm. It's a pretty cool, really handy market, right where you need it. That chicken. That is finger lick and frickin' fried chicken. Really good. So that guys is mm, me having a really happy ending. And I hope you added up how much I spend in a day. I bet it was under I bet it was about 1,400 Something like that pretty good right so until next time oh wow